I'm gonna do a grocery haul because this was a humongous order for me. It was like $170. I don't usually order that much at once, but it was payday and I have been doing really get great at eating the stuff from our fridge. You can, oh crap. I was gonna show you how empty it is, but now there's like mole left over and some chicken wings and pizza, but for the most part, like there, there's actually not that much food in here. It's just like things that take space. Like if this was in here, if this was in here, and these boxes right here, then there's really nothing to like eat anymore. Now the freezer, we have a Chinese menu here. <laughs> freezer has a decent amount of stuff still, but most of it is not meals. There's some things that I can make. And then, like, uh, ground turkey frozen. There's a little bit of meatballs left, a little bit of fries and stuff like that on your rings. Got some uh, ravioli there, too, and Texas toast. So, we are trying to stay on budget and eat a lot of home-cooked meals, especially with the commute that we are both going to be doing soon. So, let me go through what we have. I put the frozen stuff on a towel because... Um, the table just not tolerate well with frozen stuff. Anyway, first things first, I got some laundry deter detergent. This is the type we get, the mega pack. <laughs> then I have milk and the sugar-free creamer that, because we're trying to be a little bit better. Um, I do like the sugary one better, but Berta, he requested this one, so... That's the one he gets. I did not order a uh, half and half this big, like look at this. I think this is a substitute for the bigger one. Maybe they didn't have the smaller one. Maybe, because if I got that for the price I paid, that would be amazing, but I don't think that's the case. So then the frozen stuff, I got some shrimp. I probably will make um, shrimp alfredo later because I have half and half. I have parma in the fridge. I bought a lasagna, family size. Um, really want to make my own lasagna, but at this point, it's not worth it. So that was cheap, it was on sale. I got 40 ounces, I think. However, however much that is in pounds. 2.5 pounds. 1.13 kilos of all this chicken breast and frozen. Good enough for now. I do love buy mine from Aldi, but you know, this is all from Target. Next best thing for budget. <laughs> then I thought I was ordering one of these for four dollars and something, but apparently I get two. <laughs> so yay! It's just chicken drumsticks that I'll marinate and cook one of these days. Then there's this new flavor of uh, Hagen Dazs Peppermint Park. Park. Peppermint Bark. I love peppermint bark. So I'm going to make a video of this. And then I don't know when I'm going to make these videos, but sometime next week, I'm sure. Some uh, ice cream for Racky. Peanut butter flavor. He loves this one. He loves anything. Though. We got the only butter that I like in here, which is the Kerrygold Irish butter. I'm very picky with my butters. Honestly, I like other butters too, but this is just the best one. I always buy that one. Um, mozzarella grated uh, for whatever. It's good to have in the fridge, you know? Um, then I saw this. Habanero Jack sliced cheese and then for burrito, sharp cheddar, you know, for sandwiches. Also for sandwiches, honey smoked turkey breast. He requested sandwiches. Apparently I make two luxurious meals and he just wants something simple for changes so sandwiches it is um i uh got a tomato and this is a big one i'm not mad about it um and some cherry tomatoes for salads or i think these are grape tomatoes same stuff uh, salt and pepper grinders because we were out i really wanted the sea salt one but they didn't have it so i just you know went for that Oh, what did I say? I mean, I, mean, I wanted the Himalayan salt one. Curry powder, we haven't had it the entire time we've lived. I've lived here, so I make a really nice curry sauce with rice and chicken. 
so I think I'm gonna make that with the mozzarella. Oh yeah, that's why I bought it. Yeah, yeah. Um, and then paprika. I guess we're out. I use that a lot too. Um, turquoil, crest, whitening toothpaste. Yep. Uh, La banderita, corn tortillas. And I still buy or bought um, Carpel's tor tortillas, flour tortillas, because they only have 70 calories per wrap when other tortillas have like over 100. So I was like, oh, let's make the better choice. Here, spaghetti. We got, oh, ragu sauces, the meat flavored and a garlic flavored. And then I have. Um, blueberries, raspberries, and strawberries because those are what Berto requested for his snacks at work. And then I got one red onion and two humongous white onions. Um, then for snacks at work, for Berto mostly, well maybe me too because I'm going to be commuting too. Uh, blueberry, Belvita crackers, like breakfast biscuits I guess. And nutri I absolutely hate these, they're too sweet. But he likes them. Why is one of you Americans? They're disgusting. <laughs> but see, a lot of things are too sweet for me here. Uh, that's why I like making my own foods and especially pastries. And I only eat Trash Letters cake. That's the only thing I eat here, basically, because for cheesecake. So I hate the cupcakes and regular sugar frosting cakes. They're way too sweet for me, unfortunately. Then I got Rocky some wet food because we're trying to train him out of eating wet and dry food. He's been doing pretty good, great. Here's his leftover dry food. Um, so that just so we don't have to keep throwing the food away if he doesn't eat it. So I got him some wet food and one of them is a puppy food. I thought he might enjoy it. <laughs> and a new bowl for the wet foods. I feel like I'm gonna sneeze. And then I got him these. Cause he's the best boy on his payday. <laughs> um, rib high, long lasting, beef high chew. When it says long lasting, it probably lasts him like a minute, but we'll see. I've never tried those with him. Got some uh, baby spinach. Looks like I got everything that I ordered. The only thing they might have substituted was the half and half. Uh, I got bananas, sun chips. There were only two flavors. My brother really likes the garden salsa, and he really hates the sweet potato. So, I don't like the sweet potato either. There's like sweet potato and brown sugar or something, so garden salsa it is. Ruffles, or as I say, ruffles. <laughs> and cheddar and sour cream, baked chips. And then this is for Berto. Again, he requested, can I have white bread? And I was like, no. And uh, but it says healthy white, so maybe I'll try to it with this. We'll see. It's like a white wheat bread. And then for me, whole grain, pepper rich farm. Um, because Berta usually gets this nature's own, the white white bread. This is like basically like a bun, like it's so white. <laughs> so I'm hoping this will be a nice sneaky substitute he'll probably be able to tell but he really doesn't like the cd bread so maybe he's be gonna be okay with that i don't know why he doesn't like them i love cd breads but that's it that's all the food that i got i think it's a decent amount for 170 dollars uh that's including i think tip uh i don't pay for shipment i use shipped I have a year's uh, subscription, so I don't pay for the actual shipment. I only pay um, a tip for the driver. So, yeah, there we go. Hope you enjoyed.